Matthew chapter number 2 verse number 22 but when he had heard that Archelaus did reign in Judea in the room of his father Herod he was afraid to go thither notwithstanding being warned of God in a dream he turned aside into the parts of Galilee. When you read this, you would wonder what was so bad about Archelaus? Well, let's, do, let's look at a little history on Archelaus. Well, number one, when Herod died, his kingdom was split between Herod Antipas, Herod Archelaus, and the half-brother Philip. And Archelaus was so bad till even before he was pronounced ruler or king over Judah, there was a sedition or partly partial growing into sedition where there was a golden eagle a symbol of Rome that was over the holy temple and this eagle was seen as blasphemy over the holy temple and it was torn down and cut to pieces or cut up by axe and the crowd and what happened is Herod Archelaus punished the individuals that did this about 40 youths and about two men, and he murdered them, actually, as sacrifice. And the crowd was so upset, and it was growing such a degree until, in fear that it would get out of control, he murdered, according to Josephus, almost 3,000 Pharisees in retaliation for this. This was such a thing. Archelaus was deeply hated and despised. He was such until we all have heard about how the Jews and the Samaritans didn't get along. Even the story of the woman at the well, she even told Jesus, how did you be in the Jew? Ask water of me, that's Samaritan. Because we know the Jews have no dealing with the Samaritans. They were constantly at war or at odds with each other ever since Jeroboam and Rehoboam. There's been this struggle. And Archelaus was so bad that the Samaritans and the Jews got together and went to Caesar, Augustus, and complained to remove him. That's how bad he was. So you have this murderous individual and incidentally, this happened immediately after his father died. So I'm sure that this information got to Joseph about how Archelaus had canceled the Passover and had murdered almost 3,000 Jews, Pharisees. So... If I was Joseph, I would have turned away too. And then on top of that, that same angel that was guiding him and warning him all along the way, guess what? He warned him once again. And that's why he settled in the parts of Galilee. God, we bless you and we give you the glory and we give you the praise. Be glorified and be magnified. Thank God. Amen.